I'd probably I'll give you Daniel 7 and 9. Yeah, I think it's 7 and 9. And then the other one is like 10 or something. Don't need to say that. Daniel 7 and 9. Alright. Daniel chapter 7 verse 9. I beheld till the thrones were cast down in the ancient days did sit, whose garments was white as snow, and the hair of his head like the pure wool. So the, Daniel said he saw the ancient of days. Right, the ancient of days is God, because God made the first day, the second day, and the third day in Genesis. So the ancient of days is God, and he had what? He had clothes. Can the ghost have clothes? So he must have had what? A body. Right? So ghosts can't wear clothes. So he must have had a body like you, right? Keep going. And the hair of his head like the pure wool. And his hair of the head just like the pure wool. You ever seen a sheep? You seen a sheep? Don't you don't you got hair like a sheep? So he said, God has hair like a sheep, just like you. So God got a body like you. God got hair like you. Right? Keep going. His straw was like the fiery flame and his wheels as burning fire. All right, stop that. Give me Revelation 9, uh, 9 to 13. 1 to 13. This Revelation, this Jesus. Right? This Christ. Y'all heard about Christ? Y'all don't know about Jesus? Y'all been in church, y'all don't even know about, y'all know about Christ. You read your Bible, that's good. You should read your Bible every day. Right, stay, one of the books you need to read is Revelations. That the ones I like to read. All right, keep going. Revelation chapter 1, verse 13. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, clothed with a garment down to the foot. Now hold that. So it says the Son of Man, Christ, right? Christ had clothes too. He had clothes all the way down to his feet. Right? Keep going. And and girt about the packs with a golden girdle. And Christ had a golden belt. Right? He had a golden belt on. Like you, you ever seen WWE? The wrestlers, he had that that golden wrestler belt on. Right? Keep going. His head and his hair were like, were white as, were white like wool. So it says Christ got woolly hair like y'all. God got woolly hair like you and Christ. Right, keep going. As white as snow. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. Keep going. And his feet like onto fine brass. And his feet were like onto fine brass, right? His feet were like onto fine brass. Who got a penny? You got a penny? You got a penny? Grab it. Grab it. Yeah, it might be one in here. All right. No, I got a penny. You got a penny? All right, show him that penny. Right, you see that? You see that penny? Come here, you see this penny? Y'all come here, you see this penny? Don't that penny look like your hand? That penny look like your hand. So this penny is brass. That's brass. So what what does that look like? Christ said he had what? His hair. Uh, his what? His head and his hair were white like wool. And what? As white as snow. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. And his feet like onto fine brass. So if you if you look like brass. And I look like brass, and Christ look like brass. Why does Christ look like you? You ever seen a picture of Christ looking like you? Yeah, okay. I, I See, Christ look like all y'all. Christ is just like your uh, your uncle. You see that? Don't that look like your hand? No. <laughs> that look like your hand. It's the same color. See, it look, it look like they hand. You see, it look like my hand. You see that? So Christ looked just like you, right? Keep going. And his and his feet like onto fine brass, as if they burnt in a furnace. 
and his voice as the sound of many waters. Have you ever seen a dirty penny? Yeah, so a dirty penny, what it look? It looked black, right? So Christ, Christ looked like a dirty penny. He, he looked black. No, I'm calling Christ black. He's dark. Give me Job 30 and 30. Right, so as a so you look just like Christ. Your pastor ever told you that? See, this time you have to know. Your pastor forget to tell you that Christ looked like you. Alright, bring it out. Right. Job chapter 30, verse 30. My skin is black upon me. And my bones are burned with heat. So Job, Job was a so-called wet. Right, I'm going to let y'all go. I'm going to let y'all go. You want your pennies back? Okay, thank you. All right, so see, remember that. Remember I told you what? Christ looked like what? He looked like y'all. What, what did I read? I read what? I read Revelations 1 and 9 and what? Remember, Revelations 1 and 13. If you got a Bible, read that. Revelations 1 and 13. Alright, now y'all go on here with your grandmother. See, you gotta you gotta teach them. They don't they don't know that. They they in church and no one tells them. Hey, every they gotta learn. They gotta learn who they are. You know, they, they, they walking around, they not really understanding. Right, what I, what I got you holding? Yeah, holding up, what I got you holding? Revelation 2 and 9. I remember saying Revelation 2 and 9. Revelation? Yeah, bring it out, Doc. Revelation chapter 2, verse 9. I know thy works and tribulation and poverty, but thou art rich, and I know the blasphemy of them which say they are Jews and are not but are the synagogue of Satan. So he says, I know the blasphemy of what? That say they what? Of uh, Jews and are not, right? He knows our tribulation. So we already know. So we, we understand our oppressor does what? He's a culture vulture. He took out, he, they, they're, going, they're probably going to church with what? Images of what? White Jesus. And a pastor, I asked him, say, your pastor ever told you that? Say, no. But now they know what? Jesus looked like them. Now they know what? God looks like them. That's something that's important. Right, keep going. Uh, bring this out. Uh. First Maccabees 3 and 48. And lay open the book of the law, wherein the heathen sought to paint the likeness of their images. Right, they lay open the book of the law, which is this Bible. And they like they like the heathen wanted to paint the likeness of the images. Now, when you read the Bible, Job is what? Job 30 and 30 it says he was black. If you read what? The New Testament. Revelations 1 and 9. Hey, I gotta ask y'all a question. Alright, well, I'll let y'all go. Hey, hey, can I ask y'all a question? Oh yeah, I gotta go. Alright. Okay. Alright. So I, I we already know what? That these people look just like us. When you go through the history, they look just like us, but they what? They paint the images to look like them now. Because they want to what? Take our blessing. That's what Esau always wanted. He wanted to take our blessing. Right? Hey, can I ask y'all a question? Can I ask y'all a question? Y'all ever been to church? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Y'all been to church, right? What y'all learn in church? You don't be paying attention. It's all good, you know. I, I was young. My, my grandma used to smack me in the back of the head for sleeping in church, right? But what, what I found out when I came up and grew up, I understood what? I understood that blacks are the true Jews of the Bible, right? They, they'll put in the pick what? Moses is white. Christ is white. Job is white. But they didn't live white lifestyles. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold 
on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. We hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm dealing with these two. I'm not even. I, we he just he just took it, he just put his two cents in. I was, you know, we we under. No, hold on. No, we, 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 we no, no, we, we, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We, we, we having a. My father, my father was for the fans. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to tell y'all. I'm not trying to be, I'm not trying to be for y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all. All right, go. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just told fans. Show us. Where's your sources? He has a Bible. He's putting his Bible. Hold, hold, hold on. New York, because you don't have a source. You just talk. Where is your source? Look, where's your source? These two don't know who they are. They don't know their nationality, right? I'm trying to give it to them, right? Right? I'm trying to show you, right? So, look, look, hold on, hold on, hold on. Look, I understand what you're saying. Just like there's history now that's not even known, right? I understand. It's black. It's black people everywhere. It's black people in China, but I'm just dealing. Where they took that from? Jerusalem. All right, but I'm gonna show you right here. So they will say what? They'll they'll show all these images of what? Christ, Job, and all these men. They'll say Paul is white, right? That's the main people they run to. Paul is white. What is that? Give me Acts uh, 21 and what? Acts 21 and 35, 34. No, they call him uh, they call him an Egyptian. Yeah, give me Acts 21. That's the English. English Acts white man, my well, 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 Hold on. Hold on. What? Hold on. Hold on. Give me, give me Acts 13 and 1. Yeah, I'm Alright, so we're gonna we wanna show you, right? Damn, y'all niggas don't never have shit. Right, got it? Where's your source at? Where is your source? Give me Acts 13 and 1. Where's your Excuse me, Hebrew. Yo, I got I got a microphone out not as loud as y'all. I got a microphone in out not even loud as y'all. Yo, yo, look, look, this is way out of order, man. This keeps happening. Look, he just annoyed the dude. He's not gonna say nothing. He's just not. He's not gonna say nothing. He could throw his two cents in there. We not we ignore him. He's not gonna say nothing. But you talking is feeding him. He likes that energy. We're gonna deal with him in order once we're done with them. Everything is decency and order. Right now, he's just gonna cause chaos and it's not gonna cause time. I'm saying what I said. He don't have no source, so he ain't nothing. Bro, hold on. You don't even you don't even know if he has a source. Cause he, he's talking. Because he's not even speaking right now, right? He's talking. We don't even deal with him right now. Alright, hold on, hold on. Bring that out. Acts 21 and 38. Art not thou that Egyptian? which before these days made us an uproar and led us out into the wilderness for 37? Verse 36, for the multitude of the people. No, 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 no. All right, verse 26. Then Paul took them in, and the next day purified himself with them into, into the temple. So this is this is Acts what? 21 and Acts 21 and 26. And it says, Paul took them in and purified himself in what? In the temple. Right? Keep going. To signify the accomplishment of the days of purification, until that an offering should be offered for every one of them. Right, so... He, he he purified themselves. They went. They fasted. They they washed themselves before they went to the temple of God. Right. Keep going. And when the seven days were almost ended, the Jews, which were of Asia, when they saw him in the temple, stared up all the people and laid hands on him. Wait, He said unto the chief captain. So Paul was led into the captain, uh, ca uh, the castle, and he said to the chief captain, the, 
the head captain of the army at that time, right? Keep going. May I speak unto thee? He said, can I speak to you? Right, keep going. Who said, canst thou speak Greek? So the chief captain, after he said, can I talk to you? He said, can you speak Greek? Why would a Greek person ask another Greek person, can they speak Greek? Right, keep going. Are not thou that Egyptian? He called him a what? Egyptian. He called him a what? Egyptian. Why did he mistake Paul as an Egyptian if he's what? If he's white. Why? Right, so Paul is so a uh, so-called white man. Why would he mistake him as an Egyptian? Right, keep going. Which before these days made us an uproar and let us out into the wilderness 4,000 men that were murderers. 4,000 men, right? So he mistaked them as an Egyptian. You gotta understand when Moses left out of Egypt, he looked like what? The people of Egypt. Jerusalem is not even that far from Egypt. So we know that the Egyptians were what? So-called dark people. Why would Moses be white? Why would Joseph go 77 souls? Because we know black is what? A dominant gene. If 77 people went into Egypt white, they're going to come out what? They're going to come out black. So it doesn't matter at the beginning, even though Joseph was a dark-skinned man. He went in there and what? Moses was what? He was black. He was dark. So if Moses is an Israelite and Paul's an Israelite or Hebrew, the Hebrews are what? Dark-skinned people. Right, give me uh, Acts 13 and 1. Thank y'all. You know, I just want to let y'all know that y'all the chosen people of God. Y'all got to come back and keep the commandments of God. We will. All right, we out here every Saturday, 3 to 4 p.m. Okay. All right. All right, I'm going to ask you a song. I'm going to turn it over, ask you a question. All right, let me ask you. Yeah, I'll let you teach y'all. I ain't gonna.